Okay. It is Christmas time. It is Christmas time here in Mexico. And actually in front of this place, maybe if you're from here, you can tell me, why does everyone seem so addicted to Coca-Cola in this country? Everywhere I go, I see people with it. It's a whole store. But that's not what today is about. It's Christmas time in Mexico. And I want to bring you guys along and show you kind of how it is here at Christmas time. All the people, all the festivities, and it's pretty interesting. Wait till we get up here. And I don't know if you guys are new around here, but one thing I'm gonna do is, this is all raw. I saw someone in the comments a while ago, they said, Luke, it's so cool to just be going on a walk with you. And that's kind of what I, that's kind of what I want you all to feel like. That you're just here in Mexico City going for a walk. Kind of seeing what it's like, all the people, all the life. Gracias. And you can see it's completely full of life down here. And we're coming out to the main square. I'm not even sure what the name of the square is, but you're about to see in one second. It is, it looks amazing here at Christmas time. And this is Mexico City. <laughs> and you really get the feeling that there's 21 million people here. Now this is a weekend that I'm filming. It's not like this every single day, but oh my goodness. And I'm so glad some of you all are enjoying these little videos, these little simple, little going for a walk with me videos. And that's how I want you to feel. I want y'all to feel like you're here. And I can make you a promise right now, all of you watching this, the reason why you keep watching this is because either number one, you desire to have a very similar life where you're working towards doing that right now. And the one difference I've realized with all the people who I talk to about stuff, traveling and all that, the difference is courage. That is the only difference. You just need a little more courage. I'm going to have a video coming out in a couple days as well. I'm going to have a video coming out in a couple days as well. Talking about how uh, a lot of you all want to sell your things. You want to sell your stuff and just travel full time. And I'm going to have a video coming out to show you exactly how to do that. And also, because I'm filming these kind of videos, any questions you all have, I don't want you all to feel like a stranger. I want you to feel like you're welcome. You are welcome here. I don't care where you're from, your background, any of that. You're always welcome here on my channel. And right now we're going for just a little bit of a walk here in the center of Mexico. Looks like I'm not the only one filming. So one of the things that I really love about being here in Mexico is it's so full of life. Hola. <laughs> it's so full of life everywhere. Despite everything, look at this little dog. I don't know who he's with. <laughs> Which is kind of the square. And in this square over here, they have a lot of, um, a lot of events going on. In the night, they had like little concerts. But you can see this place is huge. And this is like just one, this is like one little area of Mexico City. Like one little small area downtown where you can kind of get and find, buy, have anything you want in this area. You can find it here, guaranteed. Bon provecho. <laughs> and the people are all so friendly here. The one thing I've realized is, as much as I try not to accept it, <laughs> I'm kind of like a genetic celebrity anywhere I go. And the people are so shocked at my height. And I'm wearing shorts and I just see everyone staring at my legs <laughs> like it's not real. But how do you feel? How do you all feel about here? I mean, check it out. This is Mexico at Christmas time. And I've actually never walked this way, so you guys are coming with me. And I wish I had planned for this. Uh, I wish I had planned for this video better than I did right now. I kind of have nothing to say. <laughs> oh, pardona. I didn't plan for this video at all. We're just going for a walk. Christmas time.
And how do you all feel about here? Would you feel like you could fit in here? Because one thing I talk about is a lot of times in countries where you're not from there, you get a lot of eyes and people looking and you can kind of feel the energy in between. All, not all looks are the same. But here everyone just is like doing their own thing. So different from any other place that I've ever been at Christmas time. And I would walk through that market area, but it's just it's a lot of people concentrated in one place, more so even than here. And this is all new to me, by the way. I never walked this way before. But one thing I talked about in some other videos, you can remember, there's places to buy food, scarves, jackets, literally anything you need here in Mexico, you can buy it almost on the street, very easily. And usually on Saturdays and Sundays on the weekends here, the places are just kind of open. So they'll just have uh, the roads open for you to walk on, to ride on, to cycle on. Reforma is one area where definitely on Sundays. Oh, wow. And one thing, as I said, here in Mexico, so much tradition. So much tradition. Now, I saw a couple of people post stuff like this on YouTube from the Dia de Muertos, the Day of the Dead. And maybe some of you watching, you probably know more than I do what's actually going on here. I actually have no idea. No idea. It probably it has something to do with the holidays if I had to, if I was a guest in person. And also a lot of people, I, got, I kept, keep seeing a lot of questions about safety. People asking me about how safe is it here? How safe does it feel? I mean, you guys see me, I'm walking around and I stand out a lot because number one, I'm wearing shorts. If you can notice one thing I saw someone talk about was when you are trying to blend in, all local people always wear pants. Only like the tourists wear shorts. But can you feel? Do you feel unsafe here? And I would say there's enough police. There's enough police and uh, police and military here that I think everyone should be perfectly fine. Well, this is Mexico. This is Mexico City. Literally, this is the heart of Mexico City. Welcome to Mexico. <laughs> And like I say, I wish I had something planned to talk about here, but I actually have nothing to say. This is one of those videos where you guys just get to kind of walk around and just see what it's like. And if you had to point to like one thing, one little theme or thought, hola. <laughs> one little theme or thought, it would be courage. I promise you that's the biggest difference for me to be able to travel and do stuff like this. It's courage. Hola, como estas? <laughs> Sí, habló en español, ¿eh? Oh, tú es guapa también. <laughs> the people here. <laughs> wow, the people are and the people are so friendly. The lady just looked at me and blew me some kisses and said, "Oh, beautiful." <laughs> but wow, here we go. You can see there's so much going on. You almost probably never need to shop inside of a store. Everything is outside. And the craziest thing is I've been here for like a month and a half and I have not even seen this area. 
This is like a whole nother side of, whole nother side of Mexico. <laughs> or Mexico City, definitely. And it looks like there's a market inside there, actually. I'm not gonna go in there. Not that I'm against being around people, but I don't like being too congested around people. That's a little bit too much for me. Hola. I like being out where I can breathe and walk around. And always, always in places like this, I always say, just be careful. Be careful with your things, be careful with your stuff. <laughs> Hola. <laughs> The kid's always looking. <laughs> Goodness. What do you all think about this? So much going on. Tacos, food. And a lot of people are asking me to make videos about the marketplaces. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to stop this video here. We're going to do a second part of here in Mexico City outdoor market and uh, give you guys a good view of all the stuff that's actually going on here. So on that note, this is Mexico around Christmas time. The lady's actually making pink. Hola. <laughs> making little pancakes behind me. But this is, this is uh, Mexico, Mexico City Christmas time. You can see so much going on. So many times I walk around, I don't even know everything that's going on. But the thing that I notice is just kind of being there, just being walking around Mexico City at Christmas time. That's it for me. That kind of does it. So on that note, thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. We're going to have a part two of this video. We're going to walk around and explore all the things here. So that part two will be out tomorrow. So thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. And I'll speak to you all later. And in the meantime, everyone always remember. Remember to work hard, be brave, and don't forget to smile. Ciao.